President Donald Trump once again encouraged voters in North Carolina Saturday to send in a vote by mail and then to go head to the polls on Election Day to double-check their vote was counted despite previous warnings from election officials who said it's unnecessary, could cause longer lines at voting places and even contribute to the further spread of coronavirus, a move that led Twitter to block his tweet for violating platform guidelines on civic and election integrity for the second time this week. Trump has continuously attacked mail in voting and raised concerns about the process potential to be ripe with fraud, despite there being no solid evidence that ballots sent by mail widely jeopardize the integrity of elections. Because of the coronavirus pandemic, the 2020 presidential election is expected to have record-breaking numbers of votes sent by mail, with the New York Times estimating some 80 million ballots could be sent by post. Critics of the president have accused him of infringing on voting rights as he continues to slam mail-in voting, arguing he is railing against the method to dim voter turnout on the left as polls indicate he is facing an uphill battle against Democratic nominee Joe Biden. Trump again suggests North Carolinians try to vote twice, which is a felony. Forbes, North Carolina warns against voting twice after Trump urged supporters to do otherwise. Forbes, Trump encourages North Carolina residents to illegally vote twice as he continues to attack mail-in ballots. Forbes, election 2020 battleground states. Here's how they'll count mail-in ballots. Forbes.